Now, the reason I pick symmetry as our starting point is that it is a universal concept based on our innate symmetrical instincts, which arise from the very structure of our bodies. And that's why the clue to our deep structure project is to be found in the highly symmetrical formation of Mozart's main theme. Now, this theme begins with the chain we've already discovered. And this phrase, which is two bars long, is immediately countered or answered or mirrored, if you will, by a complementary two-bar phrase, thus producing a symmetrical four-bar structure. But symmetry is not necessarily balanced. That's a precept we learned long ago, and it's worth saying again. And what Mozart has done, as any great master does, is to make the leap from prosy symmetry into poetic balance, that is, into art.